I rise today to thank my colleagues in advance of their affirmative vote on House Resolution 329, which designates today, May 15, 2019, as Pennsylvania Arson Dog Appreciation Day. While we often hear of the great service that men and women in our emergency services provide at these very dangerous fires, quite often we don't hear about the details of what leads to the investigation and ultimately conviction of those that commit arson. Uh, in Pennsylvania, our, as with across the country, our arson dogs are silent investigators. The arson dogs, also commonly called accelerant detection canines, are taught through extensive training to sniff out minute traces of accelerants that have been used to start arson fires. Their sense of smell is 100,000 times more acute than a human. Arson dogs save fire departments and their communities both time and money. These canines locate more accurate evidence samples, reducing the amount of time of costly analysis by laboratories, speeding up investigations, and provide a higher conviction rate. Nationwide, there are estimated to have 31,000 intentionally set structure and vehicle fires in 2017 that resulted in 280 civilian deaths and $657 million in property damage. It's clear arson dogs play an important role in public safety efforts. Joining us today on the House floor, to my left in the speaker's box, is Bethlehem Detective and Deputy Fire Marshal Doug Norstein, his wife Nikki, and arson detection dog Silver. Can we get them a round of applause, please? Please rise. Sir, come on out to the well here for a moment. Is that okay, Representative Ferry? Okay. Silver was added to uh, the detectives department ranks uh, last year and is actually sponsored by State Farm Insurance. Uh, she is one of 11 arson dogs in Pennsylvania and aids with fire investigations across the Lehigh Valley. Now Silver has a, a pretty significant distinction. St Silver was key in actually detecting the evidence that was needed to convict a man who actually lit a church on fire twice in Bethlehem. That was in Bethlehem, correct? Um, yeah, so Silver so, so did a fantastic job, and the, the individual was actually caught within 72 hours. Um, the extensive training and hard work of arson dogs in Pennsylvania and across the United States should not go unnoticed and unrecognized. Um, when we break, Silver is actually going to be down in the caucus room and actually do a quick demonstration on how she does her job in finding accelerants. So I encourage you to join us at the break in the caucus room. Uh, in the meantime, I, I wanna thank the detective and Silver and, and all of the arson dogs, not only in Pennsylvania, but across the nation that aid our law enforcement with putting these criminals that are committing arson away. Uh, the detective will be over in the speaker box for anybody that would like to get their photograph with Silver. So thank you, and thank you for being here and the great work you do for our Commonwealth.